Okay, <clears throat> top of the hour, time to get started. Thank you for being here. I do not see any of my JB partners yet in attendance. Uh, that may change here shortly, but we'll see what happens. And uh, a few things I wanted to talk about, which is the basically the timeline timeline for success in info marketing. A lot of people ask me, okay, so how long can I expect this to take? And let me give you just my best example um, of someone who's done it here recently. And this really is a good, this is a good sort of yardstick to measure yourself against. So we've got Bill DeWeese, uh, who it is now Bill DeWeese, and this is his site, which I will show you here, voice-over-training. And so that's him and his site. And let me just give you, so Bill DeWeese came to an event of mine. It'll be three years in, well, three years in a couple of weeks, I guess. He came in early December. So December of what's, this is 2013, and he came in 2010. So, and he has had, you know, a, a progression from, gosh, I don't know exactly, but let's just say 25K to 50K to maybe eh, 85K. So year one, and then down here to year two, and down here to year three. So when people give you this nonsense that you're going to make a million dollars overnight, that's all it is, is nonsense. It's just a lot of hype. But this is what's happening. Now, the interesting thing is that um, a few things are going on here. First off, um, in order for him to build that kind of a following, he had to have you know, great products and services. And he also had to... Uh, Build a list. And he's got basically two lists: an in-house list, in-house list using webmarketingmagic.com, and let's see, make this a little bit larger here. Whoops. Mm hmm. Wonder why that's not. Hmm. Extend this. Oh well. So using webmarketingmagic.com, he also has a list, a YouTube subscriber list. And if you go to, we go to his channel, and I'm going to pull that up here, YouTube, and build a lease. If you go to his channel, you will see that he has and I don't know if you can see this number right here, but it's 3505. So that means that he's got 3,500 people subscribed to his YouTube channel. And that's significant because those people have all said, hey, I want to know the moment you release another video on YouTube because I'm really, really interested in your what you do. So the other thing is that's happening now, and this is something that is just coming up. Um, Bill, I'm, we're going to put on a, uh, what are we calling it? Voice over University, I think we're calling it. And that's going to be coming up here in Las Vegas, February the 15th and 16th. And we're going to hold it um, here in Las Vegas. And it's going to be for, I think, a max, what did we say? Maximum of max of 100 people and they're going to be paying I think somewhere was it I don't know if we've come up with the exact let's just say it's 297 so we have a potential of generating what is that zero zero on the end of that so thirty thousand dollars from the event just from registration there's going to be product sales there is going to be sponsorship monies and let me explain to you here what's going on okay so assuming we had 100 people that showed up paid 297 dollars there'd be gross revenues of about 30,000 product sales meaning how much stuff is bill going to sell let's just be conservative here and say he's going to sell another 
oh, let's say $7,500 worth of stuff. Uh, sponsorship dollars, again, being conservative, let's say we got three or four sponsors, let's say we do $3,500 in sponsor money. So we're looking at another $40,000. Now, the beauty of doing these events is <clears throat> that means that for, for the 100 people that came and paid the $297, they get to attend the event, be there in person, but then we're going to have the after the event sale of the video slash audio, and gosh, who knows what that'll be. I think that over the next the course of the next 12 months after that, that could be another you know $30,000, probably easy. So there's a lot of dollars that can be generated, but again, this couldn't have been done. All of this right here could not have been done without this, which is a steady movement in the positive direction for an information marketer. Now, this is how it happens. This is how, this is how you build a real business as opposed to some fly-by-night, you know, get-rich-quick kind of scam. Uh, this is how you build an information marketing business. And so you should be patient, understand that it is going to take time and it's going to take some effort. But with consistent effort, it's going to happen. Now, Bill is doing this, by the way, at the same time that he's building his voiceover business. And so he's got really his voiceover business, which generates him over $200,000 a year in voiceover work. But he's also got his information marketing business, which the beauty of the, beauty of the information marketing business is, is he can make money in his sleep, um, and he's finishing up right now. Um, his he's going to be doing something else here, which you should sort of and again use this as a means to figure out what you could do for yourself. So he's got a program that we're putting together. It's video, and it's the top 100 questions that voice over artists need to know answers to. And so this is going to be about, and I asked him how long this was coming out to, but just let's, let's assume that each video is five minutes. That's five times 100. That's equal to 500 minutes. And if you divide it, let's make it easy. Let's make it 600 minutes. Say each one's six. So 600 minutes, that's about 10 hours of information. And the way that we're doing this is pretty simple. And again, something that everyone here um, who's listening or watching the webinar can do as well, which is that, you know, you could do the same thing. The top 100 questions that people need to know in your field. Again, videos running from five to six minutes. And what you do is you set up a very simple website. And if you wanted to, you could use my buddy Dave Hamilton, who is the web marketing magician. And he's webmarketingmagician.com. And so you can set it up so you have a simple site, a site with two pages. Page one is the sales copy or video or whatever. And page two, this is what Bill is going to do, is all of the stuff you get access to as a member. So what we did is on that second page, which is going to be a very, very long page, we divided up these videos into, I think it was, was it three or four different categories? Marketing, this is in the video, and the voiceover business. Uh, performance, performance, Equipment, I think, I forget, but there are about four categories. So if you picture this, there would be a long web page divided up into four sections, one for each of these different topic areas, performance, marketing, and I forget the other, uh, equipment, I forget. So what you can do is you can, again, develop a very simple site, and, and if you need help on this, talk to my buddy Dave Hamilton, and he's Dave at web marketing magician okay and so you've got david web marketing magician.com and he can help you to figure out and set up this very sort of a simple system because the beauty of this is once it's set up you've got the first page which is selling the program 
And then you've got the second page, which has all of your materials. And by the way, all these materials that are protected, and this is a sort of a protected page, password protected page. And so that page two, password protected, page one, sales page. And then you can, you can, you can display audio, video, text, whatever you want on that web page. It just basically gives you the key to unlock the door that gets you into that page. Now, the beauty of doing it this way is you have no delivery cost or hassle. You just give people a password and they go there. Now the question becomes, you know, do you allow them to download? And I say in general, in general, no. Um, and then you're wondering, okay, so what do you have to do? You have to be streaming, it's called, streaming the audios and videos. Obviously the text can be, you may want to set up the text or the PDFs to be able to be downloadable, or you don't have to as well. So you have everything set up, but the streaming of the audio the videos can be done with Amazon S3, and that's a system that Amazon allows you to use to host and to stream your audio and video very, very, very inexpensively. And this comes out to literally, depending on how much people are using it, um, my bill I don't think has ever been over 12 bucks for the month. So this is, and, and that's with a fair amount of usage. So Amazon S3, if you're not really familiar with how to do all these things, again, I suggest you contact Dave. He does this all day long for a living, and so you may want to talk to him about the how-to on this. But this really is the best way to do it. And in fact, all of my clients, and including my own stuff, and by the way, I want to announce something here. All of you should take a look at uh, this site. Uh, we just set it up, fredandbobbly.com. Bob and I are holding a seminar in New York City, and we are doing this January the 25th and the 26th, So, and it's cheap. So January 25th, 26th, two days. So two days with Bob and me, and that is going to be so fredandbobbly.com. And it is, I mean, it's literally like $197 for two days. Why? Because we're trying to create a product. And that's the primary reason for doing this. So I would encourage you to go there, sign up if you're anywhere near. I have somebody who signed up yesterday who's flying in from Germany for this event. So um, this is worth doing. So take a look at this, and you can read all the copy here. It's a long sales letter page. It's got all the stuff. But take a look at that. And if you if or, or if you know anyone, so go ahead and get people on board there. Um, and what we're doing is again, we're going to use the same system here, which is once recorded, and we're going to videotape, vid video record it. So we're going to have the video along with the audio. And once done, we will set up a page, and page one will be the sales copy slash videos slash testimonials whatever you need, and page two will be the content, which in this case will be videos from the event. Now, the beauty of this is it requires very, very little work, very little effort and energy, but um, in, as we are doing the, uh, the actual compilation, or putting the videos together, um, it will be recording them live at the seminar, the only problem is I'm not sure if we're going to be mixing in, as we call it. I don't know if we're going to be mixing in the, uh, the slides as we do them. Now, ideally, it would be nice to be able to have a finished, sort of a finished product um, done and completed uh, that is, you know, that is fully mixed. Meaning to say, you, you shoot the video and you have a PowerPoint presentation going on, and while this is going on, you're creating a video which has the PowerPoints sort of mixed into the video. Or what you can do is take the video and then you can cut the video in later and that's probably what's going to happen here depending on whether or not I can get some people who know what they're doing to help me um, at the event itself. But again, it's the, the beauty of mixing it in as on the fly as you're going is you basically have a sort of a finished product when you're done and you don't have to do any editing. 
The, op the second option is editing, which would require taking the video and then sort of splicing in the PowerPoint presentation. And uh, that's, nah, I'm not really sure what's going to happen, but that is a second option as well. Now again, once this is done, we're probably going to set up the second page and we're going to, we're going to divide this up into probably like hourly. So in the course of two days, let's say we'll have either seven, uh, probably no, actually more, somewhere between maybe 12 to 14 hours of video. And what we'll do is we'll cut them up into sort of one hour chunks or thereabouts and have them uh, laid out on that second page with some copy to tell you what's in them. And there you have it. So that's, that's going to be sort of the process. Now, if anybody has any questions on anything I've covered thus far, now is a good time. Just go ahead and enter your question in the question box and I will try and get to it, depending on how many we have. So go ahead and enter any questions you have if you need any clarification on anything I've covered thus far uh, in terms of giving you some ideas there on how to do things. Because again, we're trying to make this business of information marketing as simple and as easy as possible. And I want to make sure that you're understanding it before I move on here. Now again, usually what happens on these webinars is I have my joint venture partners like a Vish or Bill or whatever on the calls and you guys are sitting here sort of watching and, and asking questions and listening in as we as I talk to them but they're all busy which is a good thing because they're actually working but I like to do these anyway but what happens is depending on how many questions we get that's basically all I wanted to talk about today so I'm gonna give you a chance to ask any questions and if you don't have any questions then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move to, uh, to close out the session.